Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Hope everybody's having a wonderful day or night. And welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do another freaking Transformer review because I love some freaking Transformer. Today, we take a look at Fans Toys Variator. This is FT56. This is their gears. Here's the box. Looks good, as always. There you go. On the side. On the back. Right there, you got the pictures or anything. I know it's going to be backwards, uh, so if you want to, I uh, showed the little card that it comes with. You can pause it and read that if you want to. All right, so let's just get right to the review. Hit those likes, shares, prayers, and care bears for me first. And if you haven't subbed already, uh, go down there and hit that little sub button too. It really helps out the channel. And uh, yeah, let's just get right to it and let's talk about some fans toys, Variator, or their gears. All right, good stuff. All right, before we take a look at Variator or gears, we'll take a look what it comes with. All right, it comes with a nice, nice credit card stock kind of card. So there you go, Fans Toys, Variator. And you're going to pause for the cause. It's the same thing that's on the back of the box. And you do have some stats and everything, so that's pretty cool. You get the instructions, and they're pretty good as always. Very nice. So you get this nice little, um, like, welder kind of thing, tool. Um, it is die cast, so really nice. And this is sharp, so be be careful. But you get that. That's nicely done. You get two guns. You get this one. Love that blue. Baby blue. Plastic, you know, uh, paint right there on there. And then you get his gun too as well. And once again, the blue paint looks really good. Now this does fold up like that. Now you can combine these two. They make you a, a longer rifle. You can push this back too as well. And do whatever you want to. And then you get five extra faces. You get this happy face for gears. You got the nice blue eyes and kind of a grayish kind of paint right there. These are face plates, not uh, new head skulls. You get this one, which I he just I mean bugging you, I guess. I don't know. Very nice. And you get the kind of smirking, kind of little smiley face. Looks good. And you also get the, you know, once again, kind of mean bugging. He's disappointed in you, what you've done with your life and everything <laughs> type of thing. And then the screaming, you know, what your parents used to do at you. Very nice. So there you go. That's what he comes with. All right. Here is Gears in his truck mode. I think it looks good. I love, like I always say with Fans Toys, their paint, man, this blue looks just spectacular. It looks liquid, like a liquid blue. Looks very, very nice. I like it. You got the grill. That's uh, got some nice gunmetal silver. Uh, this red, I think it's just plastic. And you got the translucent blue right there for the headlights. Look good. Rubber tires, very nicely done. Nice um, um, chrome for the uh, rims. Looks really good. Now you do got this nice translucent light blue, and then I guess it's covering like you know a silver paint or anything. But I got like two indentions or something, creases or something. I don't know. Kind of weird, but you know it's there. You got the nice blue right there. Very nice. All this blue is painted. You got the red. Now, this red right here is die cast. It does have some die cast, so it's got a nice weight to it. This is painted. I think this is just regular plastic, and this is uh, painted as well. So, very nice. Looks good on the back. You got that. You got a little, little space in between there, but it's not terrible. And then on this side. I think the truck mode looks good. Really, really nice. Really faithful to the uh, G1. There you go underneath. If you like that kind of thing, it rolls just fine. Like I said, nice, uh, nice uh, rubber tires and everything. So there you go. Oh, and also you do have storage for the weapons. Uh, it kind of looks goofy, but you move this right here, and it kind of hooks in. There's a little slot right there for the focus. You can slide it right in here, and the same goes for the other weapon. Just move that and slot it in there. And you do have storage weapon. I mean, storage, you know, for the weapon. Storage for the alt mode, golly. Uh, looks kind of goofy, but, you know, it's there if you want to do that. Hey, options are always great for Transformers. And boom, there you go. There he is next to Fans Toys Jazz. I think it's Jive is what his name is. There you go. Got some scale for you.
All right, here is Fans Toys Gears. All right, looks pretty good. There's head sculpt, looks very nice. Got that like gray paint right here. The red on this is painted. Uh, the chest is not, uh, the red is not painted, but the white is. And you got the little red triangle right there. Uh, the blue, like I said, it looks like liquid paint. Looks really good. I like it. That's painted. This is painted, kind of a grayish, a uh, little gray uh, right there. Now, like I said, this is uh, die cast, and the legs are, most of the legs is die cast, except for the feet. So, like I said, it's got a nice weight to it. And this red plastic right here is a plastic, and then the blue is painted. Looks very nice. All right, articulation. It's really got some good head, artic head, head articulation, especially for the shape of it. So you can look up quite a bit, uh, not much down. You know, it's a flat surface and you got the chin and everything. Side to side, and you get a little attitude as well. You can lift up a little bit and get some attitude. Very nice. I like that. Pretty cool. You got some die cast up in here too. This feels like die cast too, but I don't think it is. But all right, you can go up to there, all the way around. Got a nice elbow bend. There you go. You do got a bicep swivel and the fingers are all on one pin and they can open and just uh, get in there. Okay. So the hands, they're all on one pin. The thumb does not move. It does have a swivel too as well. So that's good. Just like mainly, just like fans toys usually does. All right. So you do have a waist swivel. Looks like you got a face. You got two eyes, a nose, and a little mouth right there. Uh, you got the waist swivel. You do have an ab crunch, and you can look up. Not the most, but you know, if you do a little ab crunch right there, you can look up. So that's good. Doesn't defeat the purpose of the ab crunch. I like that. So you got these little skirts right there, and right in the front one. But I don't like this. I don't. They only made one. They didn't cut this in three. They made it just one flap. Nah, don't like that. I wish they would have cut that. That looks kind of silly. But uh, you can Van Dam all day, every day. You can kick up. Nice ratchets. Daddy likes that. Back a little bit. That's good. Thigh swivel. Put this down. Put that down. Got a yeah, about 90 degree knee bend. So very nice. I like that. Uh, you do t have a, not a total up or down, but you have a decent rocker. So that's not bad. Kind of wish they would have gave them a toe tilt up at least, but they didn't. All right. And the back cleans up pretty good. You got a little backpack. Not terrible. I like that. But cleans up really good. Once again, the paint is beautiful. I like it. All right. So you do have two weapons. Like you said, you can open this up right here, maybe, if I can get this my finger in there. And you basically just take the weapon right here. And there's a little tab right here. And it goes into the back of the hand, which is okay. I like it. And close that. And there you go. And you do the same thing with this, or you can uh, combine them and make a longer rifle. That's cool. And you do got the face plates. And how you do this, you just open this up right here. Untab this right there. And you can put the screamer face whichever one you want to and close it up and there you go that's how you change it now, it does have the gimmick as well where you can open up the chest and you do got some nice sculpt work and paint in there it's all gray and uh, blue and you got like a little aqua little thing right there so that is awesome very nicely done when they changed out his um uh emotions or whatever uh i think it's like a vhs tape in there it goes in there something i remember that's pretty cool or something like that but yeah that's cool that's a nice little little throwback to that one episode very nice so there you go that is fans toys gears oh i forgot to show you about the welding thing okay so for some reason i can only get it on this hand right here you just close it up you you know put the fist in and then there's two little tabs and you just tab that in and that goes in but i cannot get it on this one at all it will not it just will not go on there so i, I don't know what the deal is I can only put it on that hand and everything. So, and we got MP44 Optimus Prime. We got the Generation Toy Side Swipe. We got the, uh, you know, and Masterpiece uh, Side Swipe back there as well. Then we got Fans Toys Power Glide and Pipes. We got Core Class Wheelie and then Tits McGee Red Gar Scale. And Crappy Glonage, Crappy Tool Paper, AAA Battery, Car Mix, Care Bears, and Kicker and Squeaks. More Scale. All right, folks, let's talk about some Fans Toys Variator or uh, their gears. Overall, really solid, solid release. I like it. They've been really 
pretty good with their uh, mini bots and everything. This one's really good. Love the alt mode. The truck mode looks really faithful to the Jeep one. Looks really nice. Um, you know, can't say anything bad about the truck mode. Looks really good. I like it. Uh, transformation, you know, it's a breath of fresh air. You know, it's another E2 one. Uh, not easy, but, you know, just like pipes, you know, it's a fun transformation. Now, Power Glide was, you know, something different. But um, the last two releases, the transformation has been really fun. You know, I haven't, you know, wanted to throw it across the room or anything like that. So, really good on the engineering. I like that. Bot mode looks really good. I like it. Everything. Only thing I don't like is the skirt, the little front skirt. I wish they would have, you know, made it into three pieces instead of just one solid piece. That's kind of old school thing going on. Uh, I don't like that. But other than that, looks good. I like it. I love the accessories. You get the two guns. They're nicely painted. You get the nice uh, chromed out uh, or... Um, you know, yeah, chromed out or, you know, die cast out a uh, little welding tool. Now, like I said, it only fit on my left hand. It wouldn't fit on my right hand. So, you know, but, you know, it's fine. And you get the extra faces. You know, you get the grumpy one. You get the screaming, the smiley one. That's awesome. And you also had this, you know, little, um, you know, um, gimmick right there with all that. That's awesome. They threw that in nicely painted. Uh, Paint-wise, as always, fans, toys, beautiful. I love this blue. Like I said, it looks like a liquid blue. The weapon and everything, the red. Very nice. I like that. So really good on the paint as always. Articulation, pretty good as well. Uh, even for the shape of his head, he does have some nice head movements. You got everything you really want except for maybe a um, you know butterfly. Other than that, really great on the articulation as well. Got him some good poses. Um, what else was there? Uh, it has uh, some die casts on the legs and the uh, all the legs mostly. Nice weight to it, so very nice. Uh, materials feel good. Didn't think I was going to break anything. You got some nice ratchets in the legs. That's nice. So yeah. Overall, nice, uh, you know, a solid, uh, you know, a release for Fans Toys once again. I like it. He's my gears. You know, I don't need another gears for MP scale at all. So, yeah, hope you like that review. Hit me up some likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Hit that sub button for me if you don't mind. It all helps out the channel. It really does. Hit me up some comments. Tell me you thought of the review. Did anybody get this guy? Are y'all going to get this guy? And I guess I'll see you in the next Transformer review. And as always, be good to yourself. Man, hell freaking Transformers and hell freaking Fans Toys. And good night, folks. Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? If you made it this far, I really appreciate that. So, who they got left over for, left for the mini bots for fans toys? Um, I know we need a wind charger. Definitely, I don't have that. Uh, we're getting and tailgate. I think this is the repaint for him, the white car. Uh, we're getting a swerve next. I think for the retool and recolor of him. Um, they need a cosmos, but I like the X Transbots cosmos a lot. So if we don't get one for fans toys, I'll be fine. Um, wheelie, definitely need a new wheelie. Uh, the X-Trans bots, it's okay, I guess. I mean, it's fine and all, you know, in bot mode, but, um, definitely could use a new wheelie. Um, I can't think of any other ones. Uh, if you have any other ones that you would like to have, uh, as far as mini bots, hit me up in the, you know, comments. You know, the Bumblebee, you know, you do got the MP1. It'd be cool if they made one. They did the Cliff Jumper. Um, but, you know, I don't know if they want to step on, you know, Hasbro's toes because Bumblebee is, you know, one of their money makers. Um, but there's some other ones I'm, I'm sure I'm probably missing. I bet definitely need wind charger. Uh, that would be really cool. So yeah, very nicely done. Uh, another great uh, release for the fans toys. Uh, you like it? Hit me up in the comments and tell me if you like uh, some fans toys. All right, floor time. Gotta love it.